What's up everybody, Camshaft here with another episode. So today we're going to be talking about moving into the new commercial building, uh, what obstacles I've run across, and also we're going to talk about some mining problems and how to diagnose some uh, GPU cards. Stick around. All right, team, so we are back. Uh, coming from you live from Mine 1.0. Some of our cards are located in this uh, vicinity somewhere in Tampa Bay. I uh, can't give you the exact location. but um, So we're having some issues here. Uh, the problem that we're coming across is a low hash rate on a new car that's just been hooked up. We're getting uh, 4.164 uh, mega hashes on this guy. And then also on a couple cards, we actually one of our cards, we have to pump it up to like 140 watts. That's just not right after BIOS mod and all that stuff. Let me let me give you a, a, a quick view of that. So as you can see, you know, this guy's running about uh, 144. Uh, this one, which I don't know if it's defective. Um, or there's just a setting is only sitting about 40 watts. And then the other ones, uh, these two 480s are 100 watts, and they're doing just great. They're running at uh, 23 mega hashes, respectively, um, continuously with uh, 400... Uh, mega hashes on Pascal, which I, I I'm happy with that. You know, at 100 watts um, in this area, so we're we're gonna try to diagnose a couple of these cards today, and uh, and teach you that. So if you hear the AC in the back, that, that's one of the things I wanted to talk about today. So I uh, picked up an AC unit from Best Buy, and it's the Insignia 10,000 BTU, and uh, this guy's actually doing pretty well. Um, considering it is hot in here you know i could definitely feel it it's over 80 degrees uh fahrenheit in here and i tried another one from honeywell it, it was a um 12 000 btu it's a i'll tell you what honeywell i give it to you for making a super quiet product but uh for mining um it's not doing any much better than the insignia uh 10 000 btu um at half the price so i'm well, I'm going to go ahead and keep that. I got it for an open box deal, a uh, great deal from Best Buy. So I'm gonna, we're going to keep the uh, Insignia here at uh, Mine 1.0. Um, so with that being said, let's go ahead and get into our diagnostics. So to be honest with you guys, the first thing I did was I actually changed out um, this particular card. I want to see if it's the, the riser or I want to see if it's the actual card. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and reboot, and we'll come right back. All right, all. So we learned something here. Uh, looks like this car. Something inside here is faulty. You can see we're getting six uh, mega hashes on this other card. So I know two cards aren't effective. So that tells me that we have an issue either with the USB cable or with the actual riser itself. So we're going to come back, and we'll go ahead and uh, diagnose it. All right, guys. So it looks like uh, one of the hookups over here just just didn't like being matched up with uh, USB versus the One X. So with playing around a little bit, um, I was able to get us back up to uh, nominal, you know, 23, 24, 23, 22. So uh, we're hitting 95 mega hashes with uh, two 580s and uh with two 480s so uh with that being said guys i really appreciate you guys being around today um it's really hot in here so i'm gonna go ahead and head home <laughs> leaving uh mine 1.0 if you guys have any questions about exactly what i did uh please leave them below uh but essentially it's just trial and error kind of trying out uh usb versus the one x nothing was actually um defective i found it was just more of just tinkering with uh you know what connections go where so looks like everything was solved with that guys have a great day